And there it is. The old UHF antenna has been properly mounted up in the attic. We are getting excellent reception of DVB-T terrestrial digital television. Well, let's go ahead, do a bit of a tour and take a look at what this antenna is aimed at. There it is. Well, I took a tram, not really knowing where it was going to bring me, but as you can see, it definitely brought me into the right direction. There it is. That's what we're interested in. There it is once again. Hope you can hear me over the traffic noise. We are getting closer. This is what my DVB-T antenna is aimed at. This thing also does FM transmissions, but for some reason our antenna is not aimed on this one. It's aimed on a, uh, a different transmitter up in the mountains. Hearts. That's not that easy to visit. The T stands for Telecom. Unfortunately, this thing is not open to the public whatsoever. Unfortunately, it seems like the whole site is surrounded by all kinds of bushes. Look at those things right there. Well, look at that. That sign warns you that during the winter ice could fall down from the tower. As I already said, the thing is not open to the public, but looking at that entrance right there, maybe they were thinking about it. Well, look at that. I found a rather sad looking info thing. It's only in German, but still, I'm going to zoom up to it so you can read what it says. Just pause the video. No, they don't tell you a whole lot of interesting stuff on this thing. Basically, it's just how high all the different sections are, what kind of material they used, how much material they used, how heavy the thing is, nothing about frequencies or anything relevant like that. Interesting fact, they started building this in March 1989 and it uh, 
was finished and all ready to go in November 1992. Well, I have to say, that does look kind of inviting. There is another one of those signs hiding behind her there. And this may look like some kind of an entrance, but it isn't. Not even for the people that work here. I'm not sure if you can hear that on camera, but I can actually hear a faint noise that might be coming off of this thing. Anyway, there you have it, the Hanofa radio and television transmitter site. Thanks for watching. That thing looks like uh, for microwaves. I thought they weren't using that technology anymore. And there you have it.